Ten years. Ten years since my parents were killed in a car accident. I've never completely recovered from losing them. You never really get over something like that. Considering all that's been happening to me lately, I thought maybe I should go and meditate at their grave a little this morning. I'm happy that you could come. Lucas, come on, Lucas, come and play. You can't spend your whole life just sitting in the corner. Lucas. Lucas, you coming? I don't want to, Marcus. Leave me alone. I've about had it with you, Lucas. You're always off by yourself. You never talk to anyone. You never play with anyone. I'm starting to think maybe you're crazy. You're weird, that's for sure. Is that bad? Come on, do me a favor. Just play with everybody this one time. How about hide and seek? We could go play in Hangar 4. No way! You know we're not allowed to play in there. Who cares? We can get in through that hole in the fence like last time. Nobody will see us. We can get inside the hangar from the back door. Good idea. Let's do it! Are you coming with us, Lucas? It's gonna burn. Marcus and the others will get caught in the fire. Quick, I've gotta warn someone. We've gotta save them before it's too late.
Lucas, what are you doing here? I thought you didn't want to play. Get out of here now, Marcus. The hangar's going to explode. Huh? How can that... Don't ask any questions, Marcus. Get out now. It's about to explode. I'll keep looking for the others. to explode. You gotta get out of here right now. What kind of crap is this? You get out of here and stop trying to ruin the game. You are going to get out of the hangar right now. I'm not kidding. Shit, Lucas, you're a total nutcase. Get out of here, Kurt. The hangar's gonna blow. You don't know what you're talking about. You're just a retard, Lucas. Kurt, you gotta listen to me. There's gonna be a fire. You need to get out of here right now. I'm not kidding. Go on, beat it. Before I break your face, you jerk. Your mother sent me to find you. I'm gonna go and tell her that you're messing around in here. What? My mom? You say one word to her and you're dead meat. I'll deal with you later, freak. What are you doing here, Lucas? The game's over. Everybody's gone. You can come out now. Oh, that's just great. Why didn't anybody tell me? Lucas, are you hurt? No, just a few scratches. And the others? I managed to warn them in time. They, they all got out. How did you know it was going to happen, Lucas? I saw it. I saw it before it happened. Don't ask me how. You know they'll never believe that. I know. Lucas, are you alright, Lucas? Lucas, can you hear me? I did a little checking around. Without giving your name, obviously. I was told about a person who was familiar with, let's say, unusual phenomena. I think that maybe she could help you. Here, this is her address. You know that I don't believe in any of this, Lucas, but I sincerely hope that she can give you some kind of answer. I hope so too. The report from the morgue kept me up all night. Rather than answering any questions, it just added new ones. Did the murderer intentionally give the victim a slow, painful death? Is there any link to the mysterious Kirsten case? Who sent me that email about Kirsten and why? This training session with Tyler is just what I need. I need to cleanse my spirit and just breathe a little. Damn, you look a little out of it, Carla. Are you sure you're cool? I'm fine. Why wouldn't I be? Okay. Let's warm up a little, then go for it. Let me know when you're ready. Okay. Sounds good.
One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. One last set and I'll be ready to fight. I'm warmed up. I'm ready to get in the ring. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, I'm warmed up. I'm ready to get in the ring. Pretty good shape this morning. One more set and I'll be ready to get in the ring. Ready to rock.
welcome to Las Vegas for tonight's match between Terrible Tyler Miles 